And what's up, everybody? It's your boy Uchi, and um, back again, once again. How y'all doing today? We just got a package. We just got. A All right, I'm not gonna do this blue scoops, John. We got another unboxing type of review for you guys today here on Uchi Games channel. And without further ado, let's get right into it. This is from Waterfield, and for those that don't know what Waterfield is, y'all about to find out about this protection and style at the same time. <laughs> This is dope. So let's bring you guys a little bit close. Whoa, that's really close. Just so that you guys can see this a little bit better, this is actually a Waterfield bag for the Nintendo Switch. So like I said in my previous video, I did have a temporary bag just in case I did decide to go out anywhere with it. And this is it right here. This is just your standard GameStop bag. Has the space for the Switch and some cartridge slots. So like I said, very standard. It was only like $15 anyway. And then there's a little strap right here there's like a wrist strap and then a nice cool little coin looking <laughs> zipper and that's that's it but if you wanted to really protect your switch then i actually got a recommendation from my good friend and boy catfight who actually is an owner of this himself here it is it's nice and small compact and it smells brand spanking new. I'm gonna show you guys how exactly this works. So, oh my God, the quality on this is literally disgusting. It, it, it like, it has the snap on flaps that it takes some force to open them, but they snap on without you having to like really press them in. So that's a cool little feature. Right in the front, we got some slots here to put our Switch cartridges. So I only have two games so far. I'm not really gonna have to worry about filling these Johns in. But as we go further into the case here, we have some more storage room right up there, right in here. And this is all like really smooth texture. This is like some really good fabric, leather. We got all this John right here. And then I actually ordered on the side. It doesn't come with it, so it's, it's an extra. I got myself a messenger bag strap that I can put on. These are, Wow, these are really heavy duty. Holy crap. Now these, these are gonna take some force. This is a forceful, forceful. And then obviously right in here where you see this red mesh, this is actually where the switch goes. So let me go grab my switch for you guys and I'll show you exactly how this works. So here's my switch. And with the Joy-Cons on, I'm literally going to slide right in here Okay, and I put it up against the red pouch because that's obviously going to protect the screen a little bit more. Now, right now, I don't even have a screen protector on my Switch yet. So thankfully, I haven't really gone out with it into the wilderness and or city or just the general outdoors with this. And it's very, like I'm holding it by the console. And it's gonna take, you know, a little bit more force to pull it out. So like I said, it's nice and snug. It's like Goldilocks, it's just right in this bag right here. Waterfield knows how to make their products. If you definitely want to protect your system, I highly recommend this bag. And there it is. It even has a zipper on the back so you could probably fit whatever else that you'd like to fit in here. Probably some just extra storage for uh, some cables, some USB-C's, chargers, but of course you can literally just get away with putting all that stuff right here. I mean, obviously this is not for the dock. This is just for the switch itself and some cable wires. And so let me know what you guys think about the water field bag. These are actually made in country. This is from San Francisco. So you guys can definitely check it out. I'll keep a, a link in the description. I got the crimson because I, I know I, I mess with that red light. Let me know what you guys think. Hit me up on Twitter, Discord, especially on Discord. And we'll see y'all next time.